Hey everyone, welcome back to a new vlog. So today, it's another quite excited one because I'm going home. Um, this, I mean, I've been on board this ship now for six months. I did have technically a two week break in the middle where I went home. But I mean, by the time you've traveled home and then traveled back again, it's actually only about 12 days. So now I'm actually going home and who knows, they might send me to see it again, but hopefully they won't because I need a little bit of a break. But I have six weeks left to get as a cadet until I have qualified, well, got my sea time to qualify. So yeah, that's the, that's the situation. I'm going home on Friday morning. My train is at 5.30 a.m. and I am dreading it. But today I am packing, so I'll show you the current situation so this is the current situation i'm going to send this one home because it is heavy and not going to fit my bag so that's being sent um my bed is all stripped and um, that bag is fully packed a bar a pair of shoes they still need to go in there um they'll be these shoes but these ones um yeah they're gonna go in there anyway and this bag is packed bar just like a couple of bits I've left a lot of space there I've even managed to like fit some of my PPE in which is so good um I've still got my coat and that hanging up there that's um like hand luggagey bits my TRB which is my training record book my laptop my certificates I always carry those in my hand luggage always 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 I've got my rings back on these come off when I go to sea but now they're back on which is Ta -da! so exciting and I'm getting my nails done in about Mm, in about an hour and a half so that's really exciting yeah I mean by now those of you that follow me on well most of my platforms Instagram um, and YouTube you'll know that even though I work at sea I do like to like have my like comforts of being a I don't know just what I like to do and one of those things is to get my nails done ready for going home so I'm getting them done today, which is really exciting. And they're all ready to go. And I think the plan is um, my cousin turns 24 on Friday and we're going out in London on Saturday. So then they'll be fresh and ready for that, which is really exciting. Yeah, guys, let me know. What do you want to see from me? Because obviously a lot of my life has been on board a ship and now I'm going home. So what do you want to see? Do you want to see kind of like what I eat, what I work out? like? Do you like those kind of things? Um, by the time this goes up, my workout video would have gone up, my latest one, which is me working out on board. So do you want me to do another one at home? Or, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, I'm rambling. And let me know because, I don't know. I've got creative block in terms of YouTube. So let me know. And if you want to see like my more of my day-to-day -day life, then please don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok. And it's both the same name. It's Becca underscore Taylor 25. Don't ask me where the 25 came from. I mean, it's been like that for ages, but it just so happens that I'm 25 right now. So I suppose it kind of fits. Anyway, yeah, so follow me on those if you want to see more of my day-to-day -day life. Anyway, I'll see you in the next clip. <laughs> oh, blimey. Whoa, 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 what's going on? Ah, there you go. All right, so I'm off to go and get my nails done. Like I said earlier, I have now completely packed up my cabin. I'll show you that um, probably tomorrow, but I've completely packed up my cabin and uh, cleaned my bathroom. So that's all ready for me to leave because no one wants a dirty bathroom, right? No one wants to turn up to a ship. Next person coming in my cabin with a dirty bathroom, nothing worse. So, yeah, I've done that. Please excuse the state of me. I've got like Mount Everest on my chin right now, but it's what it is. Can't do anything about it. But yeah, that is what I'm doing. So I am just going into town now to get my nails done. I'll check in later. Step one of the preparation to go home is complete. What do you think? I'm in love. I'm in love. Good morning. Welcome back to another clip. 
you're already in this video, I don't know why I'm doing that. It's just because it's a new day and I feel like I haven't started it, but I have. Anyway, here we are again in my cabin. This time, bunk is clear and I am fully packed. At least, as, I'm, as I said yesterday, I'm sending this box home, but I'll do that today. But everything else is fully packed up. That's just a few bits to take on the plane with me. But yeah, that is the situation. And I've got my new jump one from Mon Monkey. Do you say it? How do you pronounce that? Monkey? M-O-N-K-I. Monkey? Monkey? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, new jump one from them. So it's like, let me try and angle you here. So it's like really baggy, but I literally am in love with it. It's so comfortable. I don't know whether you can see that. It's like, oh my goodness, it's so comfortable. Yeah, so this is my outfit and then my skinny jeans and which is just like so old from Topshop, like so, so old. And then I've got the, hang on, let me spin you around. And then I've just got the um, Comme de Garçon collaboration with Converse trainers on. Yeah. Yeah, so that is me all ready to go. Also, did I show you these? I think I did. Well, if I didn't, here you go. Here's a proper look of my nails. So they're, I know they're a bit, they're a bit extra, but like I said, I'm getting off, so that's it. And just so you all know, I don't wear rings. Oh God, great filming Becca from me. I don't wear rings when I'm like on board. Like I'm only wearing them now because I'm getting off, but I don't wear them because obviously it's really quite dangerous and degloving them. Anyway, let's not lower the tone of this video. So I will check in probably, I don't know now, like, Probably at 5.30 a.m. Cause that's when I'm getting the train. <laughs> yeah, probably at 5.30. So that's gonna be really fun. Good luck to me. Cause I'm so bad in the mornings. I mean, it's what what is the time now? It's five to 10 and I've like kind of just woken up. Even though I've like, I've been awake for hours, like since half past seven, but I've only just woken up if you know what I mean like come to with it I'm in the I'm in the zone now so yeah being on watches is really fun with me because I'm like that the whole time like hello <laughs> yeah nothing but a bit of coffee and breakfast I can't fix eh oh, I have, um... here I am time check Oh, it's actually now at six o'clock, but I got on the train at 5.20. <sighs> it's actually quite loud, so I'm sorry I'm not with it at all. So I don't really know why I picked up my phone and then started doing this, but hey, there we go. How's it going? I hope everyone's good. I hope everyone's well. I feel rubbish. <laughs> I went to a, like a charity event last night. Off the boat, obviously, and had one too many drinks, so now I feel a bit crap. Let's bring it politely. Anyway, I will see. I'll have a nap. Let's take you in a bit. Hello, welcome to me in the airport. I'm still not used to doing this in public and I get really, really, really shy about it, but yeah, here you go, I'm in the airport. I feel like I'm having deja vu, because I've done this before. <laughs> I just wait for my gate to open, which actually we open in two minutes, so I'll walk down there now. Also, thank God I got rid of those bags. Oh my God, like, thank you, thank you. Like, and luckily I didn't even have to pay any extra because seafarers get um, double bag allowance. So I had like 40 kilograms allowance, so I didn't have to pay any extra. So that's so good. Anyway, I hope you can hear me and I'm not talking too quickly. Just got a mask on. I don't even know if this is, I everyone's wearing masks, so it's probably still a rule. <laughs> I get a bit confused with what the rules are now. Cause I know in England there isn't any, but in Scotland there are a few. So anyway, when I got off in Heathrow, it probably won't be that everyone's wearing masks. I think I'll probably still wear one though. Yeah, anyway, I'll check in later. Well, 
why is it that you always come on here like that's better their lighting i always come on here like literally about four days after i get home because i get home and it's just like manic and then i have to like unpack and anyway it's still crazy in my room right now but um Anyone else who got works at sea, can you relate? Like, do your parents just... I still live at home. When I'm not in Southampton, I live in home, at home. Like, when I'm not... Wait, let me start again. When I'm not in Southampton studying, as in, like, my college phase, during my sea phase, I go home. If I'm not at sea, I see. And home is Essex. And my parents just put, like, everything. Like, the whole contents of the house in my room, basically, it seems. <laughs> Maybe that's an exaggeration. They don't do that. But they do put quite a lot. Of stuff in my room so I always come back and it's like deciphering through everything anyway it's fine because I'm not here so they could use my room it's fine anyway yeah I just thought I would jump on quickly to say that I hope you've enjoyed the video of me getting home I know it was probably like very short and sweet and it's now what time I got home on Friday at about probably about 5 30 in the evening by the time I got home and it is now Wednesday, so it literally like Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, like five days later. Um, it's now Wednesday evening, and I just thought, oops, never finished that YouTube video off. So here I am, great vlogger that I am. Um, I'm still new, okay, cut me some slack. But yeah, I had my hair done today, which is why I can't stop touching it because it is so soft. Like any, well, anyone watching this can relate if you. Well, if you've got longer hair and then after you go to the hairdressers, the smell of it, oh, it's just amazing. And I just didn't want to touch it. Like I went to the gym earlier and I was being so careful not to get like too sweaty because I didn't want to ruin my hair. Anyway, yeah, I had different to normal. You're probably all like, why is she telling us about hair? But here you go, I'm going to tell you. I had different to normal. So normally I get either a half a head or a full head of highlights, blonde highlights, obviously. Because I'm blonde, it's probably awful lighting. But instead, I got blonde balayage. So it still kind of looks dark at the top, but it's just more blended now. So it looks way nicer. And then the front bits are blonde, like right up to there. Don't know whether you can see that. Anyway, um, and then she took quite a bit off the length. So you can see, like, it's quite a lot shorter. I mean, it's not short, but it's a lot shorter than it was. Um, so she's in, like, way better condition. It feels so soft now, which is so nice. Yeah, so I'm just in, not in bed, but I'm laying on my bed. Let's see. With a cup of tea in between my legs. Hopefully I don't spill it. And yeah, this is me just saying thank you again so, so, so much for watching. And let me know in the comments below um, what type of videos you want to see from me. I know obviously it's tricky now I'm at home because it's like... Mm, Where's the C content gone? Yeah. Um, but yeah, just let me know. And if you don't want me to post anything, that's fine too. <laughs> but just let me know. And um, yeah, I'll see you all soon. Bye.